Hey guys, this is Rohan from TFE Gaming and we are going to check out the new free kicks in FIFA 20 and also the full controls on how to use them. Oh, Walker was to score here. The score for Aston Villa on this ground. It is Ericsson. Off the ball and in! Spurs are ahead! Alright, so this was an example that was shown at EA Play on FIFA 20 and all the controls of this has been revealed. So let's break it down where to use to basically use this kind of free kick you need to be in the range where you can either dip the ball or you can curve it around the wall so you need about to be in about the 20 to 30 yards mark who to use is a big question and to take these kind of free kicks all you need is free kick accuracy so look for players with a higher free kick accuracy like Ericsson, Messi, Tony Kroos etc but if you want to curve around the free kick then you need to find players with a higher curve and a free kick accuracy where to aim so not gonna lie this is the most difficult thing this year and it's gonna take a while for everyone to get used to so this part is completely different from last year there are two aspects of aiming the ball there's one that's that you have the best way to aim is to align the last player or the second last player depending on the curve of your player that you're using and then you aim the new free kick circle over the wall if you're trying to dip it and on the side of the wall according to the foot of your player that you're using if you're trying to curve the ball as shown in the examples so the controls have changed a little bit and you use your left stick to aim and your right stick to control the trajectory of the ball so in this you swing your right stick from the bottom of the circle to the top of the circle to apply a spin of the ball to curve it towards the left side if you want to dip the ball, you basically flick your right stick from the bottom of the circle to the top of the circle to apply the dip to the ball. So the power remains the same as last year, but it just loads a little quicker, so it makes it a little harder. All you need is 1.5 to 2 bars of power, depending on the distance you're from the goal. Okay, so thanks for watching my video on the most basic and easy free kick that you can take on the new FIFA 20 free kick system. I'll be releasing more complex tutorials as we get closer to the release of the game. Till then, subscribe, like and peace.